There's always that beautiful spark that happens at the beginning of a relationship. When two people get together for the first time and they're meeting each other, they have this craving, this desire to see each other every day, every moment of every day. This magical chemistry when the emotions, this energy and motion of high vibrational frequency of love works through us and through them and then comes together when the two becomes one. It lasts for some time and then over a period of time what usually happens is it will start dying down that energy, that craving, that desire, that chemistry is no longer the same. So people often ask, why? Why is this happening? Does this mean I have fallen out of love? Or does this mean that this relationship is no longer working? Or how can we find that spark again? We need to understand that everything in life is the same. The principles are the same. Whenever we want to achieve something, whether in a relationship at the beginning, we're trying to achieve a commitment from the other side. We're trying to achieve this, um, this, this belonging, this, this, this sense of togetherness. There's only two things. Number one, it's persistence. Persistency is what allows us to achieve something, allows us to get something. But consistency is what allows us to keep that thing. It's normal with humans. At the beginning, we trying to get something, we do everything we can. We do everything and we so fueled towards it, whereas we have this emotional drive, we have this action because there's no such thing as an action without a reaction. We do things because we want an outcome. But then the toughest thing will always be the consistency. A lot of the time, whether it be in our careers, whether it be in certain, uh, what turns something from let's say a hobby, something that somebody only does sometimes or part-time, to something that then becomes a professional athlete. You become a professional. You become the best of the best. The difference between this is very simple. It's only down to discipline and the discipline and the consistency. So we should treat relationship the same. Firstly, you got to ask yourself the question. You got to say, is this something that I want? And is this something that I want to keep? And if I want to keep it, then efforts must be made. And will it take extra effort? Of course it will. To keep a relationship is simple. If you remember how you got it in the first place, so how did you get the relationship in the first place? How were you at the beginning? If you have some discipline around that and you put the effort into it, you have that consistency, then that spark will remain, it will continue. You see in life we have the saying, we say, if you're not growing, you're dying. Everything in nature is the same. You look at a plant, if it's not growing, it's then dying. You look at relationship, if it's not growing, then it's dying. So in your relationship, you need to be asking yourself every day, how are we working together? How are we taking our communication to next level? How are we understanding each other on a deeper level? How are we not even making the effort that we made before, but making even more effort every day to make it happen? So the real question you've got to ask yourself is, 
Are they worth it? Is this the one? That's bottom line. You got to ask the question. Are you willing to make this commitment? Because if you're willing to make this commitment and you have that discipline, you have that consistency and you put your efforts in, then you will see that relationship continue to blossom from one level to the next level to even eternity in this lifetime.